Hi, it's Dr. Weiner from the Aesthetic Clinique. And what I want to show you today is how much actually a cc or five cc's is. It's only a teaspoon, uh, is five cc's. So a, a syringe of filler is only a fifth of a teaspoon. I also want to show you how you dissolve filler using Hylinex right here. This is my preferred hyaluronidase. So first, let me just show you what five cc's is. So here's a teaspoon. Let's come on over here and I've drawn up five cc's of saline and I want to show you so five cc's which is five syringes of typical filler it just fits in a teaspoon do you see that so really five cc's is, is not a lot of filler and when you talk about putting in one cc or a half a cc you're talking about one fifth to one tenth of a teaspoon so that's just the first thing I want to do. The next thing I want to do is I want to take some Bellatero. And so I'm taking Bellatero. I'm going to take it out of the package here. Now this is expired. That's why I'm using it. And I'm going to put a half a cc of Bellatero into this teaspoon. And I want to dissolve it. I'm going to use some hyaluronic base with Hyronex. So let's put in about a half a cc. So I'm just injecting it into this teaspoon okay and now I want to put in some hyaluronidase it's hyalinex and what I've done is I've drawn up 0.3 cc's which is 45 units of hyalinex I'm gonna put this onto the filler and we're gonna watch how it dissolves and I don't know if this is enough but we're just gonna watch and what you're going to see is that it dissolves it very quickly. So what Hylinex or Hyaluronidase is, it's an enzyme that naturally occurs in the body. Hylinex is a recombinant form of that. And what it does is it dissolves hyaluronic acid fillers like Bellatero, Restylane, Lift, Refine, Voluma, Juvederm, Define, Silk, and so forth. So what you can see is the filler is dissolving there's still a little particulate matter there but a lot of it is dissolved and so what the research says is that you're going to get a lot of it dissolved almost immediately but it takes a total of three days to fully kick in and we're obviously not going to wait three days for it but i want to just see how much of it dissolves quickly. And uh, Bellatero is, isn't uh, one with a lot of strong cross-linking like some of the other fillers. The other fillers that have strong cross-linking are going to be harder to dissolve, have, require multiple treatments. So we're now about three minutes after the initial injection of Hylinex to dissolve the 0.5 of Bellatero. And I'm going to add another 45 units, 0.3. I'm going to see if that liquefies it. So what happens when you do the Hylinex with Hyaluronidase is it liquefies it and then the body just takes it away. And it seems like that additional Hyaluronidase, Hylinex, has dissolved just about all of the Bellatero. So I'll, I'll pour it out so you can see it, but it's really liquefied now. There's very little substance to it. Now, I agree that there's some dilution effect, but I can feel it in here that there really isn't much left of the Bellatero. So that kind of goes to show you it takes around... Uh, 0.5.6 cc's of the Hylinex to dissolve. So, so about 50, uh, one to one uh, volume of Hylinex to the filler of Bellatero. And I'll just put this on a napkin to just kind of show you that that it really is gone at this point. 
there's no there's no real filler left maybe a little bit so anyways that that just shows you how quickly the Hyalinex works on hyaluronic acid thanks a lot